did you suffer with an ankle injury recently? Do you think your ankles are weak? Do you think they are giving away? This video is all about ankle strengthening. So make sure that you watch all the way through where I'm going to give out my top tips at the end of this video. My name is Marsh Fernando. I'm one of the senior sports therapists from Perfect Balance Clinics. Um, so during my day-to-day -day clinic time, I get to see a lot of people with um, a lot of different injuries, different ankle injuries, but the first step we do is ankle strengthening. You get ankle stability, ankle strength. Um, now this video will take you through very early level ankle strengthening, and then you can progress through. Now your ankle can do four different motions, and you want to strengthen them all, all the way through on all those four movements. Now the first thing is your ankle can come up, it can go down, it can turn in, and then it can turn out. And we want to replicate the same things. Now, you can find yourself under these bands, the TheraBand, loop it against your leg. You can hold on to the band, so now the level of tension is up to you, depending on your level of pain and your level of function and your level of strength. So from this position, all you're going to do is push the band down and then come back up all the way. Now you can do this in laying, sitting um, or long sitting. That's exercise number one. Exercise number two is the opposite of it, where the band's pulling you from the other end and you're really trying to come up. Now, the other two. So you can get the band around, where the band is moving at an angle, and now you're trying to curl your ankle inwards. At the same time, if you want to go outwards, you change the angle of the pull, and then you want to make sure that ankle moves all the way through the range. Now make sure this movement is nice and controlled, it's not jerky or jolty. You want to improve that control at the same time. So that's four simple movements and how you can improve the ankle strength. Now, next step. You want to be functional. You want to put body weight through the ankle. So find yourself a step. Get a bit of resistance to, to hold on to. You can start with a double leg calf raise. Now, the first thing is you can do it on the floor. Just simply going up and coming back down. Again, making sure you don't cheat by going sideways, you're actually trying to go up in straight lines. When you get good at it, you can improve the single leg. If that seems no longer challenging, you can progress to a step. So again, double legs on the step, but the difference is on a step, you can come far further down, which works your calves more. And then all the way back up and down again. That seems all fine. You want to move on to a single legged calf raise. Now, this is replicating real life. Now, when you're walking, you're standing on one leg at a time. So, the whole calf complex, your ankle complex, needs to be strong. So, using the bands, four simple movements, followed by calf raises on the floor, single leg and then calf raises on a step, followed by single leg calf raises. At the same time, if you want to improve functional ankle strength, there's two movements you can do. You can do tippy toe walking, and then heel walking, as I will demonstrate right now. So tippy toe walking as it sounds, on your tippy toes, you want to walk. Heel walking, you're on your heels, Again, tip it to walking. Here we go. I guess that was helpful. Um, so if you want to know more information, you can click the link below. Um, if you want to know about these different conditions, um, you can go onto our website by just keep clicking the link below, which will have different articles on different conditions. If you want to see a specialist at Perfect Balance, 
click on the link below and and then some someone from our team can get in, get in touch with you and we can have a discussion i hope this video was helpful hope to see you soon